What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Spanko and today I'm excited because we're going to be opening a very limited edition item. It's an official Yu-Gi-Oh! Konami product which they collabed with another company which I'm going to get to in just a minute. But it's just super exciting and the fact that I was able to get my hands on one of these is just insane. Now if you guys do enjoy these kind of videos make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more Yu-Gi-Oh! content just like this one. We do deck profiles, combo videos, product openings but this is going to be a little bit different. It's not going to be your typical Yu-Gi-Oh! video however it's still gonna be really really hype now I'm really excited because I want to show you guys this like this box is huge and there's it's a really big box and I really want to get into it because this is just something that I didn't think I'd ever have and I'll explain a little story behind it once I show you guys what it is but it's just like very limited edition so okay let's get right into the video here we'll do the opening right now like might as well I don't want to keep you guys waiting for too long this is just something that is just insanely cool i'm gonna be honest with you i haven't seen konami do something like this in some time and the fact that it's available for us now or it may not even be available anymore is just insane bro like, and, and the fact that i got my hands on it this stuff sold out fast it was very very limited so the box is open okay so there's a box within a box how do i pull this out okay stuff fell on the floor but it's okay okay so it's covered up with another box. What's what fell? They also gave me a Hello Fresh ad. All right, get out of here. I don't need this. All right. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh my God. Okay, okay. You guys can kind of see it right here. Okay, I'm gonna pull it out. I'm gonna pull it out. This is something that's in. Oh my God. Guys, look at this. Look at that. The Yu-Gi-Oh X Adidas collection. This is crazy. Okay, how does the box look? Okay, the box looks like it's in pretty good condition. Everything's looking good. Oh, bro. Look at the design. That's like the, um, it's like the, the, the what's it called? The tablet, this, the ancient tablet or whatever. You got the pharaoh gods right there. We got the dark magician in the blue eyes. Uh, Kaiba and Yugi. Oh my. Yo, they actually outdid themselves. And the entire way around, you guys see the hieroglyphics, right? And this is kind of nuts. Okay, now. Oh, it's already sliding out. <gasps> yo, 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 yo. Yo! Yo, no way. Wait a second, what is this? Bro, this is insane. What? Okay, so what do I pull out here without damaging anything? Okay, so I, I'm, I'm trying to keep it all on camera. Here, I'll just a little piece of foam. Okay, it's like foam. It's a little dark, uh, what is this? Dark magic attack, right? That's the artwork for dark magic attack. Yo, I didn't even notice this. They're actually insoles. They have the cutout for them. And that's why I was like, oh, this is like a foam material. It's because they're supposed to go inside the shoe if you want them to. That's crazy. And they have the cutout for your size as well. Oh, that would be so cool. I'm going to keep it like this though, but that's crazy. The amount of detail that Adidas and Konami or Yu-Gi-Oh put into this is, is nuts. I'm, I'm very impressed. Okay, let's open this up. Guys. Okay, so first thing I want to show you guys, they give you an extra pair of, uh, okay, so you guys obviously can tell these are shoes. They give you an extra pair of laces that say Yu-Gi-Oh over it, and they're this, like neon green. That's not neon, it's like green and purple though. These are kind of cool. I hope it's picking it up properly. Okay, that's nuts. I'm gonna explain a little bit about these shoes once I just get into this right now, because I'm just really excited. I don't want to rip anything though, because these are going into the collection, so I want to keep these as pristine as possible. All right, I got the shoes out, but there's actually another pair of laces that don't say Yu-Gi-Oh on them, they're purple, but they have Yu-Gi-Oh on the little uh, tabs right there. What are these called again? Um, there's a Phineas and Ferb song about it. I forget what they're called. Okay, this is really cool though, okay. Put the box down for now. Oh my God, I really don't want to ruin any of this, okay. So how, do, how am I gonna open this without ripping it? How am I gonna open this? without ripping it. First of all, all the Millennium items are- Okay, girl, I'm geeking out right now. I'm geeking out. Okay, the Millennium items are being on this is really cool. Okay. <gasps> Alright, I'm just gonna show you guys one of them right now, because there's two. Bro. Look at this. And it comes- This is metal, too. The Exodia leg. I think they all come with the Exodia leg. I don't think it's randomized, so it's not like you can get one of the random pieces. And they say Dark- Does it say Dark Magic Attack? No, it says Dark Magician on the tab right there. I wanna see if you guys can see that. Dark Magician. The shoes are insane, bro. And you guys, obviously, you guys got the Dark Magician original artwork on this. This is nuts. Okay, so now let me explain to you guys a little story. Oh, wait, the laces are kind of cool. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys. The, so the laces are kind of cool. They're not the Yu-Gi-Oh laces. However, the inside, you have the soles. I'm pretty sure this is the card backs, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the card back. So you have the Yu-Gi-Oh! Soul here with the card back, which is really cool. It says Yu-Gi-Oh! on the inside of it. And then, bro, on the inside... Oh, I don't want to... I want to show you guys this. On the inside of the tab... I don't know if I can do this. Let me put this down. On the inside of the tab, you see that little... Oh, I can't... 
Let me let me see if I can get a better image. Okay, there's a little attack and defense points with Dark Magician stats. So it's 2,500 and then 2,100 defense. Oh my, the detail they put into this is insane, bro. Oh, and it has the what is this? Yeah, so right here on the tab on the back it says official Yu-Gi-Oh licensed product. That's nuts. Oh, bro, the smell of new shoes. It's like smelling a fresh card pack, like. Oh, that's such a good smell too, bro. Okay, so let me tell you guys a story about this now, okay? First of all, I'm really excited to have these. I'm never going to wear these. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, these are never going to be worn. They're just something that I'm gonna hold on to forever. Oh, and I forgot to show you guys, there's even a Millennium Puzzle right here on the tab. Oh, bro, the amount of just work they, and detail they put into this. Is there anything else I'm missing? I don't know, bro. These are insane. Okay, so again, like I said, these are never going to be worn, but let me explain a little story behind these guys, okay? So pretty much, I heard about these coming out. I heard they had slides with Adidas coming out, and then I heard about these coming out. This one in a blue eyes pair, all right? Now you guys obviously see I don't have the blue eyes pair. So basically what happened was I was like, ah, oh, this is probably gonna be one of those things that come out in a different country. I won't be able to get my hands on it, whatever. And the day of its release, I think the, the, the hour that it released, within the hour, so not right up as it released, but within the hour, I got a notification that they released on Adidas Canada, specifically Adidas Canada, which I'm like, what? We never get anything here in Canada. So, for that reason, I was like, yo, let me hop on. I need to buy these. I need to buy the blue eyes ones fast, okay? So literally within the hour, I went online and the Dark Magician ones were still available and in my size specifically, right? So I'm a size 11 American, so, or size 44 European if you're European. I think that's what the size thing is. But anyways, I'm a size 11 American, so I went and they had a size 11 Dark Magician one. I was like, okay, beautiful. Go on the blue eyes one. They have every single size available. Every single one, nine, 10, 10 and a half they didn't have any 11s. And I was debating, I was like, should I just get a 10 and a half? I'm not gonna wear it anyways. It's one of those things where I'm gonna hold it in stock. But I just, I was like, man, it feels bad buying shoes that are not your size. I don't know if that makes sense because if I ever do wanna drip out, like this is drippy, right? Yeah, sorry, bro, I can't answer right now. It's a drip or drown world and I'm dripping right now. So if I ever did wanna wear it, I wouldn't be able to wear the blue eyes ones. So I didn't buy the blue eyes ones. Looking back at it though, I maybe should have just cause like looking at these now, this is insane. I did not see, I only ever saw the Dark Magician on this side and I knew the tab was on it, but I did not know all these other details and stuff that was on the shoe. So yeah. Yeah, maybe looking back at it, I should've got the blue eyes, but yeah, so the blue eyes was sold out only in my size. It probably is sold out by the time you guys are seeing this, it's probably all sold out now. But at the time I was going to buy it, it was available in every size, even 10 and a half, which is only half a size down, but I just didn't buy it. And now I'm kind of looking at it and regretting it because these shoes are very pretty shoes. They look really, really good. I'm excited to have these. So this is a very limited edition product. This is something that I don't know if we're gonna see again, honestly. The fact that Yu-Gi-Oh is doing, or Konami, I guess you should say, is doing these collabs with these companies, and these are official, like these are, I don't know if you guys can read it, but it says official Konami license or official uh, license product. Yeah, so there you go. Just the fact that they're doing stuff like this is just insane. And honestly, it's even more insane that they did this in Canada. This stuff doesn't really happen in Canada, right? It's only usually America or it's usually in Europe. So the fact that we got these in, in Canada is dope. I don't know how many Americans got their hands on this. You know, the opportunity came and I couldn't say no. Now I'm kind of regretting not getting the Blue Eyes ones. I'm gonna put up Blue Eyes picture on the screen somewhere in the video so you guys can see what the Blue Eyes one looks like. But essentially it's the exact same thing as this one it just has a blue eyes artwork and then i'm assuming like here it'll say blue eyes instead of dark magician i don't know i want i want you guys to capture that here it'll say blue eyes instead of dark magician the stats on the inside will be like the blue eyes stats uh but yeah that's that's i think probably the only thing that changes with the shoe i'm not even sure if it'll have the millennium puzzle on the blue eyes one because that's more of like a yugi kind of dark magician thing so i don't know if the blue eyes one has a different logo or something on it but these are these are insane bro and the other shoes the, the reason i'm not showing you the other shoes because it's the exact same thing as the shoe so there's no reason to pull them both out but bro i'm I'm impressed the box is really nice the the presentation is really nice the shoe there's a lot of detail on the shoe which i did not expect i really just expected this like print of dark magician and this on it that's it so i'm really impressed by this i am really impressed by this let me know in the comment section if you guys got your hands on these two they're very limited i'm pretty sure they're all sold out and gone now so if you guys didn't get them maybe you guys can get them on the secondary market but i feel like they're a lot more expensive or they're going to be a lot more expensive on the secondary market and the reason i keep looking at them is because i'm in awe like i'm literally in shock right now so thank you guys all for watching i appreciate every single one of you i know this was kind of a different Yu-Gi-Oh video, but I, I just really wanted to make it because I just think this is such a cool product 
something that I feel like went under the radar. Here's a sole, by the way, if anyone wants to see. There's nothing special on the sole. I just really like the color combination. But yeah, these are just insanely cool. I'm really happy the fact that I can own these. If you guys don't know, I actually collect a lot of shoes. I don't wear a lot of my shoes. Like I collect a lot of shoes. So the fact that I have these and their official Yu-Gi-Oh product is just, I don't know, man. I'm geeking out right now. I'm literally just geeking out. Thank you guys all for watching. I appreciate every single one of you with that Spanko side and out. Peace.